Autism, and innovative local dance therapy classes helping these kids develop better communication and social skills. We spoke to parents who say the music and the movement is making a difference. Nice! Never thought this way before. Dance therapist Audrey Negrin is connecting with her students. Through dance, she's reaching kids with autism in an exciting and fun way. Children with autism tend to use one side of their brain, so this forces them to activate the whole brain. The class focuses on body movement, speech, and expression to get these kids interacting with one another socially. The children enjoy it so much, they don't even know it's therapy. It is proven to excel movement, coordination, memory, speech, and social skills. So that's areas that typically kids with disabilities tend to lack. In the U.S., autism affects one out of every 54 boys and one in every 252 girls. Poor social interaction, verbal and nonverbal communication, as well as repetitive behaviors are common signs. Symptoms of autism tend to emerge between the ages of two and three. <laughs> nice. Brian Levy calls the class his dance party, but it's a party with a purpose, and his mom says the therapy is working. When he started out, he was kind of all over the place, not following directions, and little by little, he started joining in the class and participating in the circle time. Now he does the whole class, follows directions, you know, his confidence level has my main goal is to see them in a typical dance class where they can go and they can take hip-hop, jazz, ballet, all these different disciplines in dance and be able to follow an instructor. And they would invite siblings of our students to join that class as well for free and also encourages parent participation. Classes are held on Saturdays in Sunny Isles. What a great class. Thanks a lot, Christy. South Florida's Alan Pitbull is talking about hosting the American Music Awards with a special appearance.